站香港，下一站香港 ，Next Station Hong Kong。Hi everyone, this is Editing Sharon. You're seeing this because I didn't get a chance to record this in Hong Kong because I was literally here and there during a short period of time, and I just couldn't sit down and talk about the trip. So yes, here I am now. <laughs> Finally, I got to do this while editing the video. The trip itself was amazing. So actually, the reason why I went to Hong Kong is just because I wanted to. So one day I was just so depressed, and then the next thing I know, I was booking a flight to Hong Kong. My flight was late night on a Friday, so I went straight to the airport from the office, and I arrived in Hong Kong at around 2 a.m. Um, I took a taxi to the Airbnb, and I finally got to rest at around 3:30 or 4. And the next day, it was Saturday. It was just like a whole day out with my friends. So you guys will see the video in a minute. It was just a typical Hong Kong, especially if you live in Hong Kong right now. It's just gonna be ordinary shots of several neighborhoods. So besides meeting my friends, the highlight of this trip is definitely just being in the neighborhood that I'm so familiar with. I didn't really use Google Map and I didn't have to use the translator app. I knew which MTR I should take. I don't know, it's just nice to see that every corner is still kind of the same. I wish I could stay longer, but I'm just currently a potato. In a Korean company, so I don't have the uh, paid lifts. So I flew back on Sunday night. So it was more or less 48 hours in Hong Kong. Some of the things I can't really explain, it's just so nice to be like in Hong Kong again, but not living there. You know what I mean? I feel like I really like the place until I start living there. So being in Hong Kong again, someone who's been away and comes back is just nice. So after the trip, I was so exhausted. Physically, yes, I was exhausted, but mentally, I was just recharged. It's just nice to take a break and go home for 48 hours. So yeah, I really hope that I can visit Hong Kong again sometime this year, but I don't really see when. As I mentioned, I don't really have the paid lives right now, so that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Follow me to a nostalgic journey in Hong Kong. The train 
to Central is arriving. Please let passengers exit first. Thank mm-hmm. you.